It's the 2nd of March. I'm Jerusha Zukthia Rath and you're watching News 24 Live. Here are today's headlines. Homes have been evacuated as fires sweep across Cape Town's southern peninsula this morning. The fires have been fueled by strong overnight winds and have damaged four homes. An old age home has been evacuated. Eyewitness News reported that around 100 firefighters are on the scene in the mountains above Musenberg. The blazes have now moved in the direction of Halt Bay and Noortuk. For Cape Town-based viewers, be aware that Okarp Savach, Chapman's Peak Drive and Boys Drive have been closed to traffic. Two men have died and at least 24 were injured when two taxis collided in Gauteng last night. Four of the 24 injured are in a critical condition. The cause of the accident is not yet known and police are investigating the incident. And finally, the Japanese company behind an experimental Ebola treatment has said their treatment is not a miracle drug but could give hope to thousands infected with the virus. Avigan, which is approved for use in Japan as a flu treatment, is somewhat effective in saving the lives of Ebola patients if administered early. Now, 15% of the 80 people given the drug died from Ebola, but we know that nearly 9,200 people in West Africa have died from the disease so far. We'll be keeping you updated on these stories and more. Stay tuned to News 24 Live.